So the most common form of hypertension is what we call primary or essential hypertension. It is a consequence of a complex interaction between a genetic predisposition and adverse lifestyle factors. We know that there is a genetic predisposition, but this is not a simple situation. We know that rather than a single gene, there are many genes that contribute very small contributions to the development of high blood pressure. And these genes need to interact with adverse environments for the blood pressure to rise. So the treatment for this form of hypertension involves correcting those adverse lifestyles and oftentimes the use of medication. There's a smaller group of people in whom we can identify a specific cause for the high blood pressure. This is perhaps in 10% of people or so. In those cases, we oftentimes can correct the problem, and this can lead to either improvement or actually resolution of high blood pressure.